Pi Hole is a network-wide add and tracker blocking program that acts as a DNS for your home network. It intercepts queries for your network and blocks known add and tracking queries before they are even downloaded. Because of this, it helps web pages to actually load faster. Since it is acting as your DNS for your network, you don't even have to worry about installing ad blockers on every device, and it also works for things such as smart TVs and other IoT devices. With several lists enacting a data cap, Pi-hole can help you to reduce your bandwidth. Today we are going to build a Pi-hole DNS server using an old laptop. The first thing we need to do is to get the operating system, Ubuntu, onto something that we can boot from. For Ubuntu, a USB stick with 4 GB will work just fine. To complete this step, we need to download Etcher. This program will flash the OS image onto your USB stick. Click Select Image. And select the Ubuntu image. Click Select Drive. Choose where you want Ubuntu to be flashed to. Click Flash. Wait for your image to flash onto your USB stick. After validating, your flash will be complete. Your Ubuntu USB drive is ready. Plug the USB drive to the laptop and use it to boot up. Follow the steps to install Ubuntu. Sit back and grab a coffee as Ubuntu install on your laptop. Now we are going to show how to load Pi-hole on Ubuntu. First, let's update. In the terminal, type in sudo apt get update and sudo apt get upgrade. In case of any problem, you can try the following commands. After the updates and upgrades complete and curl installed, it's time to start with the installation of Pi-hole. In the terminal, type in curl-sslhttps install.pihole.net bar bash. The next few screens will walk you the what pi hole is. Just press enter to continue on. Now, we have to choose which upstream DNS provider we are going to use with the pi hole. Use the up and down arrow keys to make you choice. Choose Google or Cloudflare. Choose which block lists you want to use. When you have made up your mind, hit the tap key and enter. Take a note of the IP address on this screen. This is the address we are going to use to change the DNS settings in our router. Select the protocols that you want to support. screen that warns you about a possible IP conflict. Install the web admin interface and install the web server. Turn on log queries and select show everything. It makes things easier.
time for the installation. Also take a note of the IP and password. Log in to router admin page, update the Pi-hole IP to DNS1 update 8.8.8.8 or 1.1.1.1 to DNS2 or DNS3 for backup DNS. Log in to Pi-hole, type 192.168.1.157 slash admin Pi-hole IP slash admin in a web browser and use the password to log in. Here is the dashboard for your Pi Hole. Go Group Management, a list and add HTTPS, hosts.oys.nl slash dot. Your Pi Hole is ready to use now. Please like, subscribe and share to support our channel.